picking up the two early fouls in yesterday's game could just affect the rest of your game? Uh, it affected a lot. You know, it was, uh, you know, the second foul, you know, you let it go, it's a dunk. So I kind of had to take that one, but it just it affected my rhythm. I started off with a dunk. On um, the three, I, I shot in transition, you know, felt good. You know, I was confident at first, and then just sitting for long periods of time, you know, really affected me. So uh, just got to be more mindful of that starting off the game. So how do you expect Wednesday to be different? Uh, we'll, we'll play a lot better. You know, I, I know we can't play any worse than we did. So, you know, we just got to take care of the ball, you know, get good shots. And I think defensively we did we did a solid job, you know. Um, but I think offensively we just we can't get them any ammo, you know, to come at us. How much of it was you guys and how much of it was Indiana with the offensive struggles? Um, A little bit of both. I think it was more us, though, you know, just the, the long passes, um, you know, just careless turnovers. Obviously we missed some shots as well, but – no, I think it was just the the when we had some momentum going, we you know have a big turnover that was kind of uncharacteristic of us. So you know we clean those up. They force a lot of turnovers as well, so it's some of them too. But you know I think we can control some of it. Was it something you saw in film that makes you optimistic about straining this out? No, I, I felt it. We, we, we all felt it. You know during the game. You know just I, I think we played so tight. You know uh, especially with our shots and you know just. Um, you know, offensively, but I think defensively in the half court, we did as, as good as good job. Well, not as good, but we can still get better, but we did a good job. You know, it's just turnovers, and that's so fast and transition, it's hard to guard that. Was that Why do you think you played tight? Was that? Why do you think you played tight? I mean, we just, you know, we had uh, just turnovers. You know, it just mounted on us. They went on a run, and then we can never get a rhythm going. You know, and we don't have a rhythm going as a team. You know, it's just, it's hard to. To, to get it going, and we just never find that spark to, to get us going. I mean, Larry did uh, had an and one and kind of got the crowd into it, but other than that, you know, we just we was uh, stagnant most of the night. Was the lack of offensive aggressiveness still kind of the biggest takeaway after watching film today? Um, nah, well, we, we'll go a little bit more with offense, but I think it was just more turnovers. You know, those, those are so many extra possessions we can get that we can get going, you know, making shots that we don't get a chance to. So then it makes the game harder when you got to sprint back and transition and try to guard those those guys in transition. So, you know, we'll do a better job of that. But I think it was mostly just just careless turnovers. How about you personally? What, what do you uh, have to do? Uh, I mean, just find ways to find ways to be more in tune with the game. You know, I, the foul trouble kind of hurt me, you know, but, you know, just – you know, playing defense, you know, trying to find spots where I can be aggressive, you know, with defensive rebounds so I can push it or something like that to just keep me going, cut to the basket, you know, things like that. But it's no one thing in particular. What would it take for you guys in the backcourt to maybe handle their ball pressure a little bit better than you did in game one? Uh, I think screens, uh, you know, just full court screens just to get those guys. They picked up every dead ball, well, most of their balls. So just set screens, get us free a little bit so we get ahead of steam. Uh, but I think we were just wrestling with them, you know, too much. Ronnie, how much um, – because you mentioned about the fouls kind of taking you out of your rhythm. Do you feel like um, that that was more of a cause of it than nerves? What's that? Say it one more time. Was your early foul trouble more of a cause for your lack of rhythm than uh, nerves? Nah, that was that was it. No, nah, I wasn't nervous at all. You know, just getting out there, especially when I got the first dunk. You know, I was fine. You know, it's just when you're sitting on the bench that long, it takes you a, some time to get in rhythm and and things like that. But uh, you know, other than that, I was fine. Did when you guys cut it to seven there in the second, third quarter, whatever? Mm -hmm. Is there something you can take from that and replicate in the next one? Yeah, I mean just. Just not get, digging ourselves so uh, deep with hole, you know. Um, like I said, just with turnover. I mean, we're gonna have games where we don't shoot as well, but we can control that part of it. You know, if we do that, I think we give ourselves a chance of winning against anybody. The Cavs are ready to do whatever it takes to bring an NBA championship back to the land. We've been here before, and we know what it takes. It takes grit. It takes drive. It takes hustle. It takes team. It takes 20,562. Be a part of the playoffs action. Go to Cavs.com slash tickets now to get in the game.